I don't really care about rescue requests, but let me just... I like to see who it's for. Ooh, that's not Ein's Lobby. That looks like Orange Town or whatever. Uh, oh, son of a bitch. Somebody's, like, been rescue requesting this first level for a while now. But here's the funny thing about rescue requests. You can't check and see what the difficulty is because this person might be, like, rescue requesting on easy difficulty or he might be rescue requesting on super hard difficulty. And I just, I don't like how you can't check. I wish you could check before you accept the rescue request. Anyway, open the gates of hell! Or the open gates to have hell. Whatever. Who do they recommend? Uh, Usopp, Robin, and Crocodile! Oh man, do we really want to use Robin or Usopp for this level? No. We haven't used Crocodile yet. And you know what? It might be good to use Crocodile. Let's use Crocodile. We're going with Crocodile! Oh, God, his laugh. I forgot about it. Everybody, not everybody, not everybody. But a lot of people have, like, special laughs. Ground Death! Yes! I love that move. We already know how it works, because we've Something seen him use it on you. us plenty of times. It's a big circular surrounding area of just sink, quicksand, whatever. Yeah, the open gates of hell. Yeah, we're definitely back at, like, the first town. Oh yeah, I guess Whitebeard's also doing stuff. But he was with us at Thriller Bark. What the hell? They always show that the Blackbeard Alliance is growing. We get it. He's getting more zombie drones or whatever. Yeah. At the port city, they spotted impelled down jailers chasing down prisoners. Oh, cool. I think I remember who we get on this level as, a, as an unlockable character. <laughs> it's one of my. It's, it's probably my favorite character to use in this game that we'll be unlocking at the end of this level. Vista! Yeah! Let's go rescue Vista! Hey! Hey! Mr. Three! I need you to shut your mouth. For real? Alright? We took the time. It's only fair, alright? We took the time to go save... Usopp and Robin, we can take the time to save Whitebeard's crew, okay? So, shut the fuck up. Yeah! Even though you can't play as Vista, I'm gonna go rescue him. Oh, uh, yeah, this looks this looks exactly like the first level of Pirate Warriors 1. Whatever the name of the place is. Orange Town, Mock Town, Something Town. Defeat Magellan! Or Magellan. Support Ace and Marco. Okay, so this is another one of those levels where you have to, like, split up and do two objectives at once. Otherwise, you'll fail! Oh, we've never played as Crocodile, so we gotta do the coins. Alright, Guitar, Brooke. Who can, who can pair up with Brooke? Another guitar! Surprisingly not Marco. Probably because they've never met. But how about... Ah, uh, damn it. His instruments, but I mean, I can't really pair his instrument with anyone else. Let's just do Marco and the Moby Dick. Unless... Unless I get more out of... That. Yeah, I would. There we go. 21 stars. 22 stars! Yeah, okay. Alright, attack. For real. I'm getting pretty pissed off at the fact that, like, we have zero attack coins. It's getting kind of depressing. Uh, 
Damn it. Now, what's even worse is I don't even have any, like, attack coins that can be paired up with anything else. And that's what I like to focus on the most, is attack stars. So not having those attack stars is kind of messing with my strategy. Alright, there we go. There we go. There we go. And... Uh, nothing. Shit. Oh, that's right. I think I remember that, um... One of my one of my strategies for the defense coins, you get a lot of defense coins that are like related to the marines. So once you have like those high levels, it's good to uh, just have marines on your defense slot to guarantee that they all match up with each other. But all of my marine defense coins are like one star, so that's not going to be helpful right now. Uh, that skill, crocodile. Do you have any special skills? You have one, but again, we don't have it unlocked. Warrior's Wisdom. Special attack increase. Ooh, that might be good to have. Concentration. Special attack gauge will fill up easier. Nah, fuck that. I got Sniper's Wisdom recently. What's that do? Where's Sniper's Wisdom? Sni there we go. Damage inflicted on distant enemies increases slightly. Not really good for Crocodile. I don't know if his, like, the sand that he throws at the enemy counts as a distant attack. Shipwright's Wisdom, and Warrior's Wisdom. Done and done. Crew members! Well, Marco's in the level, so I guess we'll use somebody else. Who are we fighting against? I really don't remember. All right, you know what? Well, um... Uh, Crocodile's a technical character. I guess we should use a attack character as a crew member... I'm going with Frankie. Done the berry growth. What's the secret coins for this level? 1,000 KOs, S rank, and get the enemy gates open. All right, now we'll just focus on the actual. Wait a minute. Let's have a quick look at his uh, skill list. Crocodile specializes in absorption powers of the sand sand fruit. That's not really what the power of the sand sand fruit is, but whatever. His absorption attacks can restore your style gauge, allowing you to perform a number of powerful style actions. Cool. So, what's the special icon that he has? It is the hand with the swirl. And that means that when you do that attack, it refills your style gauge. So, he basically uses his dehydration powers to restore. So start with triangle and then just do square combos. So that's how you do it. Uh, unless you do that. Counter an enemy and restore style like action. Alright, cool. So he sucks the moisture out of people. And sand fruit. How to defeat Logias. Hey, have you beat half of the game? You should know this by now, but here's the hint. <clears throat> yeah, it's Orange Town. Yeah, alright, cool. My first guess was right. Crocodile! He's got a cigar! Cool, what's his uh, taunt? Adjust his claw. What's his R2? His defense. Alright, fine, fuck it. Let's go capture the neutral territory real quick. Yeah! What's up? Sand Tornade! I love it. Oh, Crocodile's such a cool character! Oh, God damn it, man. Oh, no, you don't! Alright, so his square combo is like a claw combo. He just attacks with his claws. His triangle combo is like a bunch of sand attacks. He sends out the sand Sparta and then does La Sparta. That's pretty cool. Uh, special attack number one is Desert Giasol. I thought that's ground death. So that's different than. Okay, 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 okay. So that's the quicksand attack. That is not ground death. Ground death is when he turns the entire area into a desert and does like shockwaves. Here we go! Yay! Ground death! I was confused as to which one was which. Ah, oh, he's so big. Back off! Oh, why can't I move? Okay. That was scary. A Sparta! I can't! Yeah, absorb is a fucking thing. Alright, cool. So with Crocodile, we can always keep ourselves full of style action and kick some major ass. Huh. Yeah! Oh, God, Crocodile, man. 
force to be reckoned with. Ballerina 2 2 tornade. Ah, oh, kill him all. Fine, whatever. Who's all here? Oh, the leader's here. Let's suck the style action out of him. Ooh, that's good. Get over here. Come on, die. Are you kidding me? Damn it. Alright. Oh, he's, uh, oh, I can't suck his life force. It was in style action mode. Alright. Yeah, give me that style action. I don't get much because you're just a regular enemy. Let's board <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like Crocodile. I also like how his, his run animation is just like his Logia Sans feet. That's pretty cool too. I like I like how not every character just has random walking running animations, like they have specialized animations. Like Crocodile, he rides on his little sand. How cool is that? Ooh, we can kill lots of enemies right here. Ground death! Ground death! A hundred KOs! Yes! Love it. Yeah. Yeah. Get it? Alright, cut it. Ground Geosaur. A leader has appeared and he's got extra attack and extra defense. Fuck. This must be like a special territory that has like all sorts of connecting territories. Yeah. Suck the life force out of you! Son of a bitch! Oh, there's nobody left to kill over here. Ooh! Frankie! Forgot about him. I, ch I picked him as a crew member because he's got the goddamn radical beam! You can kill people even when they're in style action mode! <laughs> Desert Cutlass? I thought that was like the 4Kids dub name for the attack. Alright, oh shit! Okay, damn it! Vista! What are you doing here? <laughs> Ground death! Another hundred KOs. God damn, dude. I can certainly rack up the kills with a uh, crocodile over here. Yeah. Oh come on, don't go with me. Style action. Unless you're ready to fucking dance. <laughs> oh, where's crocodile? Is he dead? <laughs> Vista didn't respond to Ace's persuasion. Alright, so we gotta, like, talk to him, I guess. Convince him to stop being evil! Yay! Frankie Boxing should take care of this! Uh, come on, get close enough! Damn it, I can't reach him with boxing! Ooh, can I charge up with Sparta? No, it doesn't seem like I can. You defeated and thus failed to persuade Vista. Ooh, sh oh, oh, oh. I, I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Shit! I didn't mean to, no! I fucked up, I killed Vista. Alright, so we can't kill the people we're trying to persuade to join us. Even though that's exactly what we've been doing on every other try that we've done that. Like, every other person we have to kick their ass to get them to join us. This time they're like, no, don't kill Vista. Even though that has worked every other time. I guess because we tried to kill Vista on the Barati and that didn't work out, so they're trying a different tactic. But I wasn't paying attention. Alright. This is not even a territory, this is just like a group of things. Alright, fine. So what do we gotta do? We gotta get somebody over to Vista? the current objective. Well, what do you want me to do? You want me to just, like, sit here and not attack Vista? I'm not doing it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack him. You're attacking him, too. Ace. 
don't pretend like you're attacking somebody else. There, there we go. Look, he's uh, he's stunned. I won't attack him. I'll let you attack him. You can take the blame if he dies. How about that? I guess I'll just go rack up some kills. Oh, hey, here we go. Pirate commanders. You're a soul. See, my level 1 special is almost enough to kill these basic guys. And Perona and Crocodile are both technical characters. Which goes back to what I was saying, like, there are just some characters who are better than others. Perona, as a character in this game, she's not very strong. She's pretty cool to use, but I mean, Crocodile is like the same fucking type of character and does way more damage. And has way better attacks. What do we have to do? What do we gotta do here? Do we gotta get Marco and Ace near Vista? I guess that means I gotta like slaughter anybody who's in Marco's way. Damn it! Alright, Marco, you can go now. Literally no one here to stand in your way. Okay, here we go. Okay. Ace is over there, Vista's right there, Marco's right here, you're both near him, talk to him, get him to join us, whatever. I'm gonna get some, uh, nope, I don't need booze. 